Hey, welcome to New York. How you doing? I'm Luco. I was born and raised in the Big Apple, so I'll show you how things work around here. And don't worry, even if I don't know, I'll still have an opinion on it. Like I said, welcome to New York. First off, let's talk travel. You can get wherever you want by using your mouse. Hold down the right mouse button and move it left and right to rotate your view. Go ahead, give it a shot. Yeah, right now. Do it. When you're using the right mouse button to rotate, whatever object your mouse pointer is over, that's the center of attention. It's drawn to the middle of the screen as you spin around it. Cool, huh? Go ahead, try it. Good. Now let's show you how to move around the city like a cabbie. Fast and furious. Hold down the middle mouse button on an object you're interested in and drag it to the center of the screen. Give it a shot. No mouse wheel? No problem. Just use the arrow keys on your keyboard or nudge the edge of the screen with the mouse pointer. When you roll your mouse wheel up and down, you can zoom in and out. When your mouse pointer is hovering over something, you can zoom in and center on that location. Nice, right? Now you try it. No mouse wheel? Don't cry. Just zoom in by pressing page up and page down on your keypad. Cool. Now that you've got those navigation moves down, time to get you in the game. First thing you need to know is what people need. So click on the row house behind me. Great. See that bunch of buttons top left? Click on the information button. It's the top one. Now click on the needs tab. Okay, this panel shows what the people living in this building need. The longer the bar, the more they need. And it looks like these guys need a bit of everything. Let's play it safe and build them a coffee bar. Everyone in New York loves coffee. First, move the mouse pointer over an unused piece of ground and left click. Now, you see that panel in the top left of the screen? That's the build panel. Go ahead and click on the icons. There's not much in there now, but soon there'll be tons of stuff to choose from. Track down the coffee bar, then click on it. If you use your mouse, you can move the building around. If the building turns red, it means there's a zoning restriction and you can't put it up there. Make sure it's touching a sidewalk and there's enough room for it. See how some of the buildings in the surrounding area turn green? Green, the color of money, means they like it. Red means they hate it, hate you, and probably hate your mother too. But there are a few shades in between. Got it? Good. Now left click and build that coffee bar and caffeinate some New Yorkers. The build menu separates buildings by categories. Check the tool tips to see what they are. Now that you've built the coffee bar, click on it. When you do this, you'll see a new menu panel appear top left of the screen. Click on the information button at the top of the menu that appears. You're a pro, and look at that. Now you can see stuff like how much money you're raking in and how many people are visiting. Click on the sphere of influence button in the information panel to see all accommodation businesses that can use this business. Now you're cooking. You can turn off the sphere of influence info now if you want by clicking on it again. Now click on the customers tab. This panel shows you how many customers the business has attracted and what they think of it. If they like your business, you see smiling faces. If they think it sucks, I can tell they'll you let you right. know that too. So we're moving Trust on. Me. Whenever you've built up a building, and it doesn't matter what kind it is, you can upgrade it. Ah, yeah. Click on the coffee bar again, but this time, click on the upgrade button. Check the tool tips on the new buttons. Find Sphere of Influence and click on it. Then place the main sign on the coffee bar. When you click on an upgrade, it'll flash on the coffee bar. Then click on the flashing upgrade and come nice. out. Nice, there it is. Nice. Okay, 
Some upgrades like the table and chairs can be put anywhere within a display grid. For these upgrades, move them around the so grid we. by using the mouse pointer and the space or greater and less than well, keys that's to rotate about the it. object. The rest you'll pick you can up find along the, the table way. and chairs hey, in the capacity section. Some things you just gotta see it for yourself. Remember, don't be afraid to experiment. That's why people come here in the first place. Hey, good luck. And don't forget your pal Luco when you hit it big. Oh, and uh, just one last piece of advice. Create a buzz in the area and you'll draw people in. Find out what they want, get it built, and get it upgraded. Later, buddy. Welcome to the birthplace of cool, baby. Greenwich Village, home to artists, writers, musicians, and students, is famous for its free spirits, hip clubs, chic boutiques, and charming streets. Inspired by its anything-goes attitude, Bohemians flock here in search of acceptance, in search of stimulation, and in search of the perfect cappuccino to sit and pose next to. Thousands of university students keep the restaurants full and the bleaker street nightlife thumping. And hello, Halloween! On October 31st, Greenwich Village plays host to the country's wildest parade, which makes perfect sense, since here, every day is a good day to dress up and get your freak on. What's up? This is so lame. The only thing I can afford around here is patchouli oil from the guy in the corner. Don't do it, dude. You smell bad enough as it is. Seriously, though? I need to find a place where I can get some cool new clothes. <laughs> no kidding. It's definitely time to retire your Nobody Likes a Vegetarian t-shirt. You know, a cafe or some place to grab grub around here would be good, too. Because a guy can get the munchies. And I need an internet cafe. I haven't emailed Johnny in, like, an hour, so he probably thinks I'm in a coma or something. Lucy! Dial it back a notch. She's right, though. It'd be good to download some more tunes. And get a new ringtone while you're at it. <laughs> that ringtone is seriously sending the wrong message. Hey, what's up? And there are tons of those art student types, and they always need supplies. A bookstore would be good, too, because you can read all the magazines for free there. And Would you shut up already? We're gonna be late. Okay, we'll catch you later.
place is so off the list. Hey, you and me, we should grab a beer. Crazy, right? That place was a zoo. <laughs> 